Located in the lush Arima Valley in the northern region of Trinidad, the Asa Wright Nature Center is one of the first in the Caribbean. Its goal is to protect the natural state of the valley and create a conservation and study area for wildlife protection and recreation. In 2012, the GEF UNDP Small Grants Program funded the biodiversity conservation, ecotourism, and community development in the Arima Valley Project. The project supported conservation education, ecotourism and research, community development, and biodiversity and watershed protection. Since then, the center has improved environmental conservation and education and protected over 1,000 acres of tropical montane rainforest in Trinidad's northern range. Home to thousands of species, the center also researches insect biodiversity, monitors bird and bat movements through GPS tagging and camera traps, and conducts bird and butterfly surveys. All of this provides valuable data on the island's flora and fauna that informs the country's environmental agenda. Another fundamental part of the project is the education and outreach program. We teach our school children the importance of what we have here and the opportunities for tomorrow, please God. We have education at school that they can take to their homes. We show them the opportunities to study in this field. We give them the opportunity to see that jobs can be created, new jobs, jobs which didn't exist before. We teach them to recycle and reuse, and this is what the future is about. Between 2012 and 2014, nearly 1,500 students were visited in schools to learn about biodiversity conservation and ecosystems. The center also started vacation camps to connect children with nature at an early age and brought over 2,000 students to visit the center. We own a relatively small proportion of the valley. So we have a, that is why we need the major outreach program to encourage our, our neighbors and adjacent landowners to, to maintain their land and the forest cover as much as possible and where, where possible in the traditional crops that have allowed the current um, biodiversity to flourish. In addition to building awareness, the project also helps local communities strengthen their skills and earn better income. It offered workshops on grant proposal writing, building with bamboo, chocolate making, customer service, and tour guiding. Some participants have already developed their own chocolate or coffee-based delicacies or make jewelry and other crafts that they sell to locals and visitors. Strong community involvement at every stage, from design to knowledge sharing, was key to the success of the project. The project has become a successful example and a model to replicate. Government and NGO representatives from other Caribbean countries now visit the center to understand its work model and learn from its experience. Jeff's contribution to this project has been really very, very important. It, the project had started with a previous grant. We were able to use the, the grant funding to, to take it to a, a higher level, get it um, into our, our daily operations of, of the trust. We now have to um, find ways to continue it in perpetuity. Through financial and technical support to the Asa Wright Nature Center, the GEF Small Grants Program demonstrated that community action helps people and the environment to live in balance, supporting each other. <laughs>